Hello and welcome to uh, Pod TV Skull Show. I'm your host Cryptoflex. Today's skull is the I uh, would have been your daddy's skull on Outskirts in Legendary Mode. So as soon as the Outskirts loads up, we just want to go to the back of uh, the crash site and take Sergeant Johnson's sniper rifle and trade it for the BR. And enter in the first room. Want to jump onto the ledge above the door and then onto the roof. Crouch jump. Um, down there you can see the blind skull. I'm not really focusing on the blind skull today because it's a pretty boring skull and uh, everyone knows about it anyway. It just effect is that it gets rid of your hood and everything. Um, here I'm just grenade jumping up onto the roofs and walking across this beam. Uh, now I'm doing another grenade jump onto the roof. There we go. Um, this skull is all about timing and where you get checkpoints. Cause if you don't get checkpoints in vital spaces the skull won't actually spawn. Um, to get the skull to spawn it will take you about uh, 10 attempts and you will be pulling your hair out by the end of the video because it is really annoying. Um, the skull effect is that it increases dialogue and vocabulary in all characters so it makes them say random stuff, it's pretty funny. Uh, I've only actually uh, activated it once and the way that you activate it is once you've got the skull to spawn you pick it up and um, you have to fight off waves of elites. First it's one wave, then two waves, then three waves, and so on until it gets to six waves. It's really, really hard to do. That's why I've only done it once. So, um, yeah, and now you just kill all them guys and follow me. Now we want to jump on these barrels onto the roof. If you can get up. There we go. And then over to the other side. In. Across this red roof. Um, you will have to watch this video quite a lot of times, I've already said, just to memorise the path that I take, because it is a pretty hard path to memorise. Right. Here you go, you get the checkpoint there, then you pick up this magnum with the SMG. You want to reload it, then pick up the sniper ammo, then go around the corner. Um, there should be. Let me just check with the elites. He's used the elite on my left up here. So let's just have a look, there he is. With the sword. And there's one that comes down with the sword from behind that box. You just gotta take him out. Um sometimes there's an elite with uh, double plasma rifles. But if it, if there is just kill him and it's alright. Now we wanna go down here and take out all the sniper jackals. You want to try not to die when doing this because it sometimes messes it up. And it's not very nice. There we go. Now we jump onto this platform, onto the beam, and onto the roof. Now we want to not fall off the roof, obviously. Let's try again. Uh -huh. Right, there we go. Um, throw the grenade down there, and that'll distract the jackal that usually snipes you when you jump across here. Right, and. I'm just approaching the room now, where the skull will spawn in if I get the checkpoint outside the room. It's vital that you get this checkpoint here or else the skull won't spawn. There we go. Now that you see the skull spawn. Um, but as soon as the skull spawns, everyone just usually runs in and picks the skull up straight away. But that's a very, very newbie trick to do because um, you won't actually be able to get the skull once you've died. So this is what you have to do. You have to go and get another checkpoint. So, when you die, you'll spawn at that checkpoint and then you'll be able to go back to pick up the skull. But if you don't get a checkpoint after the, after you've found the skull, once you've picked it up, it won't be there anymore. I know it's a lot of things to remember, but it is vital that you do. Yeah, I'm just going back to the room to pick up the skull now. And now I'll have to activate it. I've just walked past the room. Right, I'm just going to go and pick it up. As you can see, I got a checkpoint as soon as I pick it up. Um, as you can see, I've spawned uh, below where we've just picked up the skull with a noob. And I'm just going to pick that BR up. Uh, as you can see, there's one elite on my radar. First things first, I just want to kill him. Now, there'll be two elites that come. You've just got to take two out, and then there'll be three, and so on. It gets pretty hard when there's three, because they're all special ops, and 
They know what they're doing. Apart from this guy, he's a bit of an idiot. <laughs> an idiot. Now there'll be three elite, three waves, three elites. Sorry. Gotta watch out for the needles because they're deadly. Thing. Oh, I've got no ammo left. No. I'm gonna die. But as you can see, you've got the rough idea of what to do with the waves of elites and everything. But once you've got to six waves of elites, then the score will be activated. Um, thank you for joining us. Next week's score will be Catch Skull on Metropolis. Uh, I hope you enjoyed today's score. Thank you very much.